I've been busy three or four weeks um, <clears throat> and there are parts of it where you feel as if you're getting nowhere fast and um, I think the fruits of that have, have come through in the last few days in relation to Lee and now Dean tonight so um, from a club perspective you know I think it's another big signing for us um, he's got brilliant pedigree um, He's actually a player I tried to sign about nine years ago um, when he was leaving Institute. He went on to Derry City and has had a, a super career that I've followed since then, but he's always one that we've kept our eye on. Um, you know, he's, he's, he's locally spaced again, being from, from Derry City, so from that point of view, you know, it ticks all the boxes in relation to what we're looking for. About a week after the same fellas, uh, Warren got in touch and um, I'm very about what I was doing next year and at, at the time I still didn't know what was kind of going on or who and so it just took another, another couple of weeks off and relaxed and then I got back to the morning we got chatting um, he told me what he wants from next year and I thought it fitted perfectly for for me like a good stories uh, about the place and uh, the club and, and as Orn as a manager too and it was always somebody I would like to uh, work under and I like the way from hearing uh, from past players um, how he conducts himself with the players and lets them go and kind of express himself on the pitch and I felt that was kind of missing for me for the last couple of weeks so it's, um, I'm just glad I can start working on their, on their again. We want as strong a squad as possible, we want as strong as starting 11 as we can get every week um, and with that I suppose the best way of describing what I wanted out of this transfer window this summer um, is three or four grenades into the squad and I don't want players that are going to uh, make up the numbers or be around the ages. I want players that are, are going to come in to the starting eleven and absolutely um, disrupt what, we, what we've had for the last few seasons. And I just feel we're at that point now where, where we need that and we need a real fresh impetus. I played with a couple of them. I played with Steve Bain. They kind of gone up through the, the underage at Derry and a few of the other young lads too. Like, so I'll, I'll, uh, I'll fit them well. So even though you knew those boys, you still were happy to come? Either <laughs> <laughs> uh, not a good lads. Say yeah. no. I think there's a huge amount there, and you know, we've seen it before. Players from within the league are really important, or players that know the league well. And um, I think sometimes when you, when you recruit from outside of the league, the hit rate on that doesn't seem to have the same success as from within the league. And the Irish league is a league where you need to know it, and it takes a certain type of player to be able to play in it. So. He's great experience north and south, um, he's still at a really good age and still in fantastic shape which is important with the way that the league has gone as well so you know he's a huge amount of attributes there but I think just that experience and, and, and the standard of what he's achieved so far and more importantly what he still wants to achieve. As a player I'd like to think I'm pretty good on the ball, I, I like going forward, um, I like getting beyond the, my left winger and putting crosses in the box and um, obviously helping the team make even people around me, I have plenty of information and Obviously I'll be using experience now to try and help the team. I'd love to get fit as possible pre-season, hit the ground running. Um, obviously improve on the league form last year and um, just looking forward to playing the football again. Uh, the, to be fair, when you're looking at the league attendance, the attendance is right up there. Um, there was always a noisy crowd when we came up and played last year and we were on the end of a few drummings, but um, hopefully we're, I'm on the right side of it now, so I'm looking forward to playing in front of them. I think there's an excitement from everybody just to get back where I think we all needed time to recharge the batteries and it had been a, a really long pull over the last two or three seasons in a great way because of Europe and everything else but I don't think we've done a proper pre-season for a few seasons because of we were just maintaining over the summer um, with such a short break so for everyone to get time away from the club and time away from each other um, sometimes can be a good thing um, and it'll bring about that that vibe and that energy again that you're looking for where we can really get to work um, and look forward to hopefully a really good start to the season.